Hello YouTube, this is allaboutandroids.com and today I will be installing Virtuous Inquisition version 2.0.1 on the HTC Sensation. Now quick note before I install this, please make sure that you have a rooted device. If you do not, there's a link below as a tutorial on how to root your phone. Now if you do have a rooted device, installing an ice cream sandwich ROM is slightly more complicated than installing a gingerbread ROM. Uh, for an ice cream sandwich ROM you need to have Super CID and you also need to update the firmware according to the recommendation of the developer. So the first thing I'm going to do is get Super CID on my phone and you need two things for that the HTC USB drivers and ADB software. So the first thing uh, please look in the uh, description you'll find the link for the HTC drivers these drivers are only available in 64-bit at the moment and once you have downloaded the drivers what you need to do is go to device manager plug your phone in and make sure it's in charge only mode and make sure USB debugging is checked and uh, what you will notice is in the USB section you'll have your phone with a triangle saying um, drivers not found so what you have to do is update the drivers search for drivers I extracted my drivers on the desktop HTC drivers and yeah just click next I've already installed them and once you have installed the drivers you uh, you'll find out that uh, your phone will be here ADB interface so now that I have installed the drivers you have to go to C drive create a folder called ADB and then post the contents of ADB windows into this folder see the four files in here are in here once you have done that you have to open command prompt go cmd copy this type cd which stands for change directory and paste that now i'm in this directory and now let's uh, get super cid on this phone so now uh, you can uh, type ADB devices to find out if your phone has been detected. If not, uh, just watch the tutorial again and make sure you did everything right. So once your phone is detected through ADB devices, what you have to type in is ADB reboot bootloader. Remember the dash and once you uh, clip uh, press enter what it will do is uh, reboot your phone into the bootloader. That's the white screen Once that is done you have to put in Fast boot OEM right CID and then eight once Make sure you know you check over what you wrote. Fast boot, OEM, write CID, eight once, press enter, and it says it's done. Now you have to reboot. So fast boot, reboot bootloader. So you, you're rebooting right into the bootloader. Again, don't forget the dash. And now your phone will reboot. Once it has finished rebooting, back into the bootloader of course, you can type in fastboot, get var, CID. And as you can see my CID is 8 ones, which means your phone has Super CID. What Super CID enables you to do is install a ROM from any, any country on any car carrier. So now that you have confirmed that you have uh, CID, you have to reboot back into your ROM. So type in fastboot, reboot, 
and your phone will reboot back into your ROM. Now we have uh, done, now that we have Super CID, we all we have to do is flash the radio or the uh, firmware package according to the ROM developer. For example, for Virtuous Inquisition, download the firmware here, download the radio or the uh, ROM and uh, put those two in the root of your SD card. When I say root of SD card, that means the very first uh, place you go when you open, a, for example, when you double click removable drive H, this is the root folder. So put both of those items here. I of course have already put them. So I have my radio, or the firmware here and I have my ROM here and now I will be showing you how to flash them. So now this is the second video where I flash the firmware and I flash the ROM. So in order to flash the firmware and the ROM you have to make sure that fast boot is off. So go to settings. See, for me it's off already. Okay, so I'm gonna turn off my phone now. So now I'm gonna hold down the uh, volume. I'm gonna hold down the volume, and uh, the, this is the uh, bottom part. So the lower volume button and the power button. And now this is the bootloader and it's scanning for uh, firmware and it said it's found it. Do you want to, to update the firmware? Just follow the instructions from there. So I'll click yes or I'll press the volume button up for yes. I want to update the firmware. And it says do not power off the device. It's updating. So this does take some time, about two minutes. Just make sure when you are doing this that you have almost a full battery. If you do not, or if your phone shuts off during this process, you will have a brick. We're almost done here. And it's gonna reboot now. Press power to reboot. Now that we have uh, updated the firmware we are now ready to install an ice cream sandwich ROM so now we have rebooted the phone and the first thing you have to do is delete the firmware from the root of the directory otherwise it's gonna detect the firmware again and it's gonna tell ask you if you want to update the firmware so we're gonna go into file explorer and delete that firmware pg image 58 and delete Are you sure yes okay now that that's done make sure the firmware is not in your root directory okay and once that's done turn off the device and again go into your bootloader by pressing volume down and holding down the power button Okay, so again, I'm back in bootloader, doesn't detect in 
a firmware so you have to go into recovery so now I'm in recovery mode this is clockworks recovery you can barely see it it's pretty dim and what you have to do of course is wipe data factory reset the phone and then you have to wipe cache the, the cache, par cache partition wipe it then wipe dalvik which will be in advance wipe dalvik that's wiped go back and now we are ready to install virtuous inquisition so install zip from sd card choose zip from sd card and here is virtuous inquisition 2.0.1 and install now this will take about five minutes to install and another five minutes until you see the um, booted phone all right so now the loading has uh, finished and I am running virtuous inquisition which has uh, tried its best to uh, get a stock uh, Android feel this is this is Android 4.0.3 as you can see there with the baseband and Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, please post them below. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll get more content for you guys. Thank you.